so far at this track Champions League, but she is our overall leader. Last lap. Valente in that light blue. Stenberg now is going to dive down and have a go. Let's see what happens. We know that Valente has a quick finish on her. Stenberg has been brilliant, the Norwegian, so far this season. Is this Jessica Valente's moment, though? Valente hitting the front at just the right time. And what a time to bring your top form. Leader since opening night in Mallorca. And now race winner for the first time, Jennifer Valente. Valente is victorious, finally and extends her lead at the top of the Champions League. That was super impressive there. After conceding the lead to Katie in that scratch race by just three points, she's been in a super impressive elimination race. Here's the moment Katie was eliminated. I feel that she had the legs, just not quite space to go into. Max heart rate 205 for Jennifer Valente. Had to go deep, of course, back again tomorrow. Who's going to recover well overnight? That's the question. That is going to be a, a big theme running through all of tomorrow night's action, whether you're a sprinter or endurance rider. Of course, the endurance riders will be more used to it. And Jennifer Valente. on her way to the Champions Gate again, and the Americans are pleased. Grant Coons has talked very, very highly about Jennifer Valente, how he wants to emulate what she's done, use her as a role model. And she, at the moment, is the top rider in the women's endurance category in the Champions League. 